This has really been a landmark historical COP, not only because it has been the longest COP of history, but also because uh, the decisions here have really marked a completely new trajectory for the climate regime. So not only has, uh, has this hard work gone into and completed uh, guaranteed a second commitment period which gives policy certainty, but it has also laid the path for a much broader climate regime into the future that will be applicable to all uh, in a legal way and has established the tools and mechanisms to support developing countries to address their efforts of both mitigation and adaptation. The results here have been the results of uh, actually quite a few years of very hard work, uh, which the South African presidency picked up and has delivered in a really astonishing uh, and remarkable way, as you all saw. So I really want to thank uh, all of the countries who have made this possible. They have really gone beyond their national interests and realized uh, that they do have to cooperate with each other to be able to put a global solution to a global problem. And finally, I just want to thank the city of Durban for having hosted us. Wish we had seen more of the city. Uh, and uh, certainly the South African government for having had us here. And above all, the South African presidency uh, for this uh, really remarkable, remarkable COP. Uh, President Mashabane herself and her wonderful team uh, with whom we had a, a huge roller coaster up and down, up and down for two weeks. But here we are, uh, completely underslept, under, underfed, uh, but very, very grateful and happy about the results. <laughs>